Stevenson drops the conference open tonight to Eastern at 80 to 74. Glenn Clark with head coach Gary Stewart. Coach, you know, you guys had a, a great first half and, and opened up a big lead. I know you're adjusting to playing without a couple of your guys right now. How much do you feel like that maybe wore on you and in the second half? Well, where we missed it most is in the toughness department. I mean, you you saw that game. It was it was uh, um, glaring in terms of the toughness piece. And so, in this conference, if you're not going to battle up, um, you're going to suffer the fate that we did. And, and I didn't think we got to that all night long. Just the physicality um, to get people off the backboard. Um, you know, we didn't we didn't follow the game plan. You know, and so we we. Um, um, you know, had some good stretches there, but the consistency to play well throughout the game wasn't there. We we didn't fake it a little inside. We shot against the contest. Um, there was a lot of things that was really disappointing about tonight. I thought that your perimeter defense, I thought your guards were active defensively and creating turnovers. I thought that was – I'd, I'd certainly understand where your frustration would be inside, but I, I thought that there was – you know, she coolly created a lot of turnovers tonight. I thought there was some pretty good – active defense on the perimeter yeah the, the challenge here and it's really really interesting it was something that kind of foreign to me at the division one level when i was at davis but the defensive inactivity where you, you do it right and you do it right and then all of a sudden you just stop and so now i'm guarding you and once you give it up instead of me jumping to the ball which should happen in january i don't care if you're a freshman or a senior we jump to the basket. So when you do that against a team like Eastern, you will pay, and you will pay dearly. And and, and unfortunately, we did that tonight. The, on on the positives, uh, Joey Lutz off the bench, you know, looked fluid, looked comfortable, looked like someone who, you know, it maybe can shoulder more of the load moving forward. Yeah, you hate to put that on him because we want to do it collectively with our entire roster. But uh, um, Joey is a, a, a highly competitive guy. He's got all the tangibles that winners have. Um, you know, that was really the attraction to him. Uh, you can see the, the skill set, but but he's a, a winner, in, and uh, we're lucky that uh, he gets to wear our uniform for years to come. And then what's the message? You know, we mentioned that you guys are down. You're, you're not getting those guys back, you know, Saturday, right? Like, it's not happening that quickly. What's the message to this group about what it's going to take moving forward in the conference? Uh, no more Mr. Nice Guy. You know, it, it just the, I, I thought that we could come and, and teach and coach in a certain level, but we're not getting the response that we need. So um, that means I'm going to shift to another gear. And so uh, it won't be for women and children. Yeah. Coach, I appreciate you not taking it out on me. I do appreciate <laughs> that and always appreciate the time. Thanks so much. Thank you, Glenn. He's Gary Stewart. I'm Glenn Clark. Go Mustang Sports TV.